Hey there viewers and welcome back. It is now time for more Darksiders. In this video I will be going up against Straga. Now first things are first though. Before I go up against Straga, I do want to backtrack just a little bit because that angel right there, Azrael I think his name was, mentioned something about this tower being connected to Straga, which means if he dies this castle could go down as well and I do not want that happening. So. I'm going to be doing a little bit of backtracking. Also, it should be noted that thanks to Andres Lavo 8, or it could be Andres Lavo 8, Andres Lavo 8, something like that, he helped me learn exactly how this friggin' portal gun works. Now, I can also cancel with the L2 button. Look at that. Nice, isn't it? Alright, now, previously I thought this portal gun was like the portal gun in Portal, where you shoot a blue gun, you shoot another blue one, and then... Alright, hold on, let me try to rephrase that again. You shoot a red one, you shoot a blue one, and then you shoot a red one, which will erase the previous red one. You shoot a blue one, and the previous blue one would be erased. Well, that's not how this gun works. Instead, it's like this. Your first shot's gonna be red. Your second shot is gonna be blue. Your third shot is gonna be blue. And the first shot, which was red, is gonna disappear. Your third, your fourth shot is gonna be blue. And your third shot is gonna turn red, whereas your second one is gonna disappear. So. It keeps your two most recent shots. That's how it works. Has nothing to do with blue canceling out blue and red canceling out red. So, to all those who get confused, that's how the thing works. It is time to backtrack a little bit, though. Uh, not that way. Come on. I'm around. So, yeah, thank you to Andres Lavo 8 or however you pronounce your name. Getting this gun mixed up with the portal gun can cause you mass confusion. Very easily too. So I need to go that way. Come on, all the way around. I could also go that way if I wanted to. But I want to do this one first. I am missing a Wrath Shard in this direction. Up the huge shaft. That's what he wishes she would say. Ah, I completely missed that, didn't I? Yep. Okay. Wait for it to come around. Oh, I can make that. What do you know? Oh, never mind then. I'll just shoot it this way. Yeah, there is another right there. See that right all the way over there? Kind of hard to see. Ow. Yeah, I'd say that's kind of hard to spot, wouldn't you? Wrath Shard, number two. And open it up. There we go. Um, there's no portal, so I'm gonna have to make that jump, aren't I? Crap. Or I could just suicide. That works too. That way I don't have to wait. Okay, back off. Seriously. I will go bird hopping on your asses. Too bad there wasn't a fifth one. I could have gotten my achievement right there. Oh well. And why do I keep calling it an achievement? It's a damn trophy. This is a PlayStation I'm doing right now. Oh, come on. There's nothing there. There's no barrier. Friggin' invisible walls. Let's see here. 
And I was also given a tip that I don't really need to do this super jump and like have a hallelujah miracle jump of faith. I can just do this. If I can start it up. And that should launch me high enough. If I can get over to it. Yeah. Come on, get in there. Oh, come on, really? Okay, I guess that wasn't charged like, strong enough. Get away! So cancel you. Try that again. There we go. I think there's a chest this way, isn't there? Let me check. Uh, la da 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 da. Maybe not. Okay. I thought there was. It's that way. Okay. So I was going in the wrong direction. Down we go. Taking the quick way. Is it this path? Or I think it is. Yeah, it is. See, how to get up there, though? That's the question. There should be something on the walls nearby. I think. Should be. There we go. Or I can just do this. Come on, activate it. Supercharge you. And put you back up. Never mind, that doesn't work, does it? Okay. Fine, play like that. I don't even know where that one would shoot off. Well, it would shoot off right there. I think that's a hole in the wall, isn't it? It looks like one. Okay, let me try that again. See if this works. Yes, it does. Good. Yeah, that's just a map of the area. That's fine. Now, the next chest should be... If I can remember. Can I reach that? No, I cannot reach it. Damn it. Well, is there any other portals I can use? No? Crap. Alright, along the long way we go. that chest. Up you go. Here it is. Okay. I knew it was nearby somewhere. Now, to actually get to it, you have to shoot from an angle right about right here. Come on. Yeah, that's not going to work. Okay. I think that... Yeah, that reached it. Okay, good. Back we go.
So now... Whoa. Kind of risky right there. We should now get the legendary enhancement. When... Fury's Embrace. This legendary artifact drastically boosts War's Wrath generation and reveals the location of all items on the current map. Yes. And let's just equip that really quick. I want you to go on my never-used Harvester. That thing is passive, right? 